Hey there everyone, Indulger here, back to close out Ether Rage Week 98. This is day 7, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Be notified when I post this series. Alright, um... From last we gathered... I think... We only didn't see starting from here. Well, let's look at the one time this team has been beaten. So, two weeks. This is week two of this Edelgard team. Boss team with the Mythics. If you haven't watched this, this is your first time watching, well, take a look at the other episodes during the week for a full detail on the defense. But, we're going to fight a Lucina. A Naga. It's a pretty decent team. Alright, so look at this, let's, let's look at this Ike. Because Ike is like the only unit I've seen that can actually break down an Adel. So, you're going to need a user that can re ignore defense, because it's a lot of defense. So Ether does that for him. It also lets his sustain build up. It also takes advantage of the fact that these Adels are really slow. <laughs> so he's going to reduce a little bit. So he's a very good counter. This is the second time we've seen Ike. Last time we saw Ike, we broke him. But that was last week when it was super stats. So I imagine this Ike would have some trouble with super stats. But he barely, he barely scrapes this out alive. Okay, so he's at 32 HP. Three damage from the thrust here. That's really disappointing. And then there's no more action because everybody's dead. There's no more jumping. Simple back up and shove. That's my favorite. Now, this one's running noontime and only gets the two heal. If I would have had a bonfire there, would this Ike have died? So, I'm going to tweak this next time because this is going to work for me. This is, I mean, when, you, when I go 90% win rate, it seems like it's fairly <laughs> decent for me, so I'm going to keep this. I'll tweak a bit of things for next time. It should make it even dumber. <laughs> and then we'll take a look at that. Next Astra season. All right. Poor Morabolus is poking, trying to kick Lucina's shoe. That didn't work. Okay. Uh, but thankfully it didn't count. So this is a perfect defensive week. Sheena will take us home for the last one of the week. And I am past the cooldown range. So there are no more that will come in that count. I have no idea why I just keep seeing all these Alphonses. Alphonsi? Like, <laughs> it just seems to be a fairly popular unit, I guess. Plus six. Okay, we finally, finally, finally have an armor killer unit here. Finna is here with her rapier. Anna's here for bonus unit status, I guess. Does she do anything? So, okay, it's the Gale Force Anna. So, they've actually invested this to the point where, okay, slaying, flashing blade. All right, so she can be competent in a Gale Force setup. Now, this doesn't look like a Gale Force team, so we're not fighting the Gale Force team. I assume they must have a Gale Force team. They did okay scoring. So they test the trap and then go, Nope. <laughs> I don't want any part of that. This is not something you can play or phase. I mean, with the double joint drives. And then I was also even dumber with the, the drive res there on Marabolus. You're not going to be able to poke this. I mean, you can poke it, but you're not going to be able to do anything. I'd love to see if anybody can play or phase this. So Alphonse will go for the hit. I'm not gonna get, I'm not gonna get hit, hurt because I'm not retaliating. So this is the first time I've actually. We'll see if Valen Shield helps. Now they're hiding the Thinna, and they just barely fail to fell the Thrasir. And is there any reason why? Yeah, I guess it's the joint drives. Maybe they did the math and they're like, yeah, I got this kill, but they either didn't account for the joint drives. Man, by one. Really was useful. And then will you pay will you penalize? Because you're also getting hit by Mirabilis, too. Fantastic job there, Thursier. Because you did that, I can beat the back line. She did. She gone. Now I can't I can't double him because my speed is just so abysmal and you're preventing the follow-up attack 
But I can't blow you away that way. <laughs> and is that enough? Yeah, Sheena's gone. Thanks, Sheena. That I mean, was a good attempt, I guess. I mean, I would have loved to see if you could have done something with the rapier. But I literally hedged for that situation. And it, it worked. So I'm happy. Plus 10 Aversa. Plus 10 Adel. Okay, plus 9 Robin. This doesn't score great, but they really, really like Adel card. <laughs> uh, okay, so let's see, let's see what we got here. We've got an Ether. Not bad. Pulse Smoke. Yeah, you guys keep telling me how much you love Pulse Smoke. I don't... This team is not built on specials. I mean, a little bit. Bonfire helps, but most of the time, Adel's going to get her bonfire in combat unless you're running guard, so I don't really care about the Pulse Smoke. This is intentionally not really a Pulse Smokeable team. Both the Thrasir and the Edelgard are going to try to get their special off during combat. Test the trap. Uh, okay. Well, actually, they didn't test the trap. They knew what the trap was. It's a little... <laughs> That's a little ballsy, to be honest. I feel like... Okay, you've got the Panic Banner there, which you didn't care about. I mean, uh, we'll see. We'll see what happens. <laughs> she gets panicked. She's gonna have to take a bonfire. She eighty was eighty percent reduces. I don't even. I forget what you even do. Eighty percent reduce the bonfire. That's good, but I mean, you've got a lot of other things to deal with. Adel again and another bonfire. Nope, you can't take two Adels. That poor Robin just did zero damage. And jump. <laughs> That's why Adel's stupid, because she has built-in orders, basically. <laughs> She's so dumb. I love this team. It's so dumb. All right, no mock battles today, because this could be... We could run, you know, a range of done in five minutes, versus this will take an hour. So, don't do mock battles on day seven. But if you want to be a part of the program, I do normally do four to five mock battles a week. Newcomers preferred... Please take a look at the video description for details on how you can be featured here on the show. And look at your defense, give you some feedback, or you can just try to make me look silly. All right, so team one was the Kane team. Got an Adel Gale Force team that I haven't used. I haven't used Edelgard in a while. I feel like we used her all the time. I don't know. I just feel like Kane's leveled up. We've got uh, a Leon team here, and then we've got this Hector team, which... Hector really made me happy. Uh, he took on a pretty good team uh, earlier in the week. Now, I didn't record day six, so I lost a ladder. I'm going to probably just do one public, and then we'll see what we want to do from there. We've got Alexis. Top 1,000 is in play. We've only lost 40 points the whole week. Uh, this is either a joke team or... Okay, no. Okay. All right, thanks, Alexis. I guess Alexis is done for the week, and they're just like... Here you go. Here's a free team. So that's like I mentioned. It could be five minutes. It could be... Uh... All right. Who wants to get the thumbnail that hasn't got the thumbnail? So we just do some clickbait. Maybe I can make something like, Leon totally wipes a team by himself? <laughs> I could. Who wants the SP? I don't know. It doesn't really matter, I guess. Let's just choose this one. <laughs> I'm always looking for some gimmick to do a fun thumbnail. Uh... They could be really nice and just not even have any any traps either. It's probably gonna take more lo longer than it should. I mean, again, I just want to make sure there are no weapons. So even if they dance, they can't do anything. So. I always feel silly like trying to plan something like this. All right, well, what do I do? If I can't beat this in seven turns, then I, I should just give up. Oh, it is going to take a bit. Did, 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 did they at least, like, the martyr will go off and the dance will go off until martyr again, maybe. Let's go. I'm up next. They were even nice to not do real traps. What is your desire? I don't know. I don't like this. I mean, you can do it, I guess, but why? I don't know. What to do now? What's next? Were they mean? <laughs> no. <laughs> this person's just a really nice... Free win here. That martyr should go off. They're trying to hide from me. But that will do it. 
Thanks. Was that Alexis, if I recall? Thanks for that. Um, I don't know, Alexis. I would have I would have actually preferred to see you. Now, I don't know. We, we did manage to get out the ether. Yay. So, that seems a bit high to get around the 6700 number. So, now I'm going to be really sad if I took that minus 40 and we leave another three ladders on the table. I was debating rematching the one person that fought me. Let's just try one more on public. Since that just took so... That was so fast. Oh, I don't like Alms. Alms got his B skill. I don't know. I was I was talking about this. I don't know to myself or Discord. Like, I just don't see a lot of Alms anymore. And the fact that there's no Alms anymore maybe could allow us to uh, bring Surter back into the fold. So, I mean, I'm thinking about it. Alright. Let's see what we got here. You know... If we could blast the Alm and then finish him, that's cool. It's a double dancer setup. We could Fjorm both of these guys. I don't ever recommend putting both dancers in the same column. Do you have party bearing? Yes, you don't have party bearing. You know, so... Altina should be able to do this, actually. Here. If I could somehow break the healing tower and get out and then go there, Fjorm these two. Dead, dead, dead. Is there orders in play? No. So that's something I see just off the bat. Will we go there? I don't know. But because you've given me one column, Fjorm shuts this down. Break both of these two. Put Altina here. Alm's not going to one-shot me. It's not a built-in Lunar Flash. Oh, maybe it is. Quick and Pulse. Is anybody running Infantry Pulse? Ah, so it is a built-in Lunar Flash. That's sad. I still don't even think he's going to one-shot Altina. Oh, that's a plus attack Alm. It's a plus... Ah! <laughs> Danger. It's a plus 10 Alm. Maybe he will. Okay. I seriously want to get rid of that Healing Tower, because then we could cheese some of this stuff. This is a plus 1... Ophelia. All right. For the, I don't know. This is I, I finally found like this Android setting where I could do not disturb, and I'm seeing text messages and Slack messages and things, and it's not it's not actually interrupting the video. So yay, it works. That's good. I might need to pause to see if anybody needs me, but um, yeah. Hold on. Let me do that. Ah, yeah, nothing important. Okay, let's get back to it. Um. So yeah, now I'm a little concerned that I'd be blown away with this Lunar Flash. I'm pretty sure you're going to have the most attack, though, so we would at least chill that. But then the, the, the next turn would be Ophelia here, and then Ike, Ike there as well. How the hell do I break the Healing Tower? I come here, smite, come back. I'd have to have a dancer to do this. Smite, hit, dancer, reposition. I'd have to have a distant... Somebody with a distant... They could also... like Okay, it could be a Leon team. But it doesn't have a dancer. Do I have any dancers this week? No dancer, no dancer, no dancer, dancer. So, okay, it could be an Edelgard team. But then, yeah, I don't really have... Anybody that could hit the healing tower. I mean, Rice Riss could do it. Riss hits it. Dance. Get out of the way. And then I guess a Naga gets the dancer to get out there. And then we can have that explosion. Does this Edelgard team have a... No. Damn, if this Edelgard had a Fjorm, we could just take these down. I just don't have quite the overlap I want. I want a Fjorm team, and then I want a dancing team. I just don't have it. Now, we could blow away the Alm, and then I... It's a 40. Probably the Ike, too. That doesn't really get me in position to get my real Gale Force off, but it's close. If Adel could be here, Smite... I actually want her here so I could test this. Maybe I just beat the Alm, Gale Force, boom, beat the Ike, but I just don't think I get Gale Force off in that scenario. I'm not running Heavy Blade. I 
can't do both. I can't have them damaged and get a Gale Force off. Can I one-shot you? It's a lot of bulk. Did I ever merge up my Adel? I got two Adels that are <laughs> just plus one. I'm debating whether or not to go pure attack or defense. What else can we do? Could we bait it out this way? This seems reasonable. I mean, what if I just put a cane here? How does the alm get me? Like, there's no ground order, so, like, why wouldn't I just put a cane here, break this dead, 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 dead alm? Is there a guidance trap? No. Is there a rally trap? No. There's no rally trap. That seems like a pretty big weakness here. I just bait the dancers. Yeah, I mean, dabbled in some Gale Force, we dabbled in some Vantage, but I, at the end of the day, it just seems like a good old tank job because they're not protecting it. Yet again, it becomes a problem with the Alm, but if Alm's the last person standing, I should be able to survive. Seriously, how do they stop this? Okay, they're gonna... If I come here... The only play... Is the Dancer. Is the Dancer somehow going to live that? She's getting a spur. But man, I don't know, that's... Not any additional defense. No defense. They're really trying to spur it up. But... Why wouldn't that work? <laughs> There's always something I'm not seeing, but it really just feels like this is the answer. You're dead, and the next play should be the Ophelia, because she just should do the most damage. Although, why is Yoon here again? Um, what is Yoon going to do? I don't think I've seen a Yoon on Anima in a while. Penalty inflicted, panic or threaten, I'd probably be... Shield in some way. She's gonna get what off an iceberg. I might literally one shot her. 66 bulk. We'll still get the spur though. So that's six. That's 70 bulk. So she might survive. This is a 35. So I could parlay the small five to try to one shot the Yoon. Should be fine. There's no Duma here. All right. I think I've vetted it out enough. Seems like a reasonable play. How are we going to get corn over there? I don't know. It's the perpetual question. Probably want to do that. Are there any dragons here? There's no dragons here, so this Naga doesn't really need to do much. Break this. Break this. Pivot. Come over here. Corn ends where that Naga on the right is standing. That puts Kane here. Both Nagas behind him. And then Kane. We could just go then. Kane breaks this, and then I smite him. And then, where's Corrin? Corrin's here. I swap in there. That doesn't go off yet. Anybody running panic? One of the things that seems really vulnerable here is that they're just not panicking me at all. I'm gonna get full stats. So, I could go now. I could go now. It's actually the, the Yoon is concerning me. I, I just don't... Oh, whoa. Oh, whoa. Okay, we're done. Yeah, I was going to say, um, how did I get so much attack? All right, so Kane's going to be 75... It's 80 attack. Yeah, I think Yoon's one shot. We don't really need to wait for that. Let's go. Yes. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. And then what do you want to do with the wrist, wrist? What are we going to do with you? I don't know. Do we want to keep that? Am I going to get hit by that? Yeah, I'm actually in danger Let's there, go. so I can't move anyway. So I can't do anything with wrist. He's got to go down. What did I miss? Dancer has to go. Dancer's dead. Barely. But I would have vengefuled her anyway. Yep, the fact that the other dancer went means the other ones aren't going to do much either. 
Good old zero. <laughs> so, okay, alm plus ten is scary, but when it's just alm, well, not much else to say. All right. Man, I really wish I would have been able to get that alm. It's going to get healed a bit. We do have this stupid lunge to deal with, so I don't like that. Oh, Riss, should I just put you here, bro? I had a chance to put you there, and then it was over. Why didn't I see that? That was dumb. I can't, I can't help you, because I, I could, no, I, damn it. I'm going to be really pissed off if I somehow blow this because of a lunge Ike. It still should be okay to do this. Because it's not a Gale Force, Ike. I just come back here. Okay, Ike will probably lunge me. You don't have Wings of Mercy, right? Don't Gale Force. I just come back. Um, if Alm wants to try to hit me, he's not going to one-shot me. And I should one-shot him in return. He's going to get 35. Maybe I'm wrong, though. 40 damage? I'll have it. He'll be at 40 HP. God, I don't want to blow this. This is such an easy one. 40 HP. God has blessed my step. <sighs> 71 bulk. Are you reducing me in any way? Again, I'm just. I, I didn't get the attack this time. Actually, he is. He will live by like 1 HP. Did I do that right? He's going to have 71 bulk, and I'm just going to get... 70 attack. That's a bummer. Ah. Taking a pause. Hold on. Okay, I mean, I could, I could run away. I could just pivot out, but... I don't have soul ready to go, and it's it's gonna hit me, hit me, and then hit me again. I can't vengeful him because of no follow up. Damn it! This is why you gotta think this through, guys. I had the answer. Wrist right there kills him. It's over. I don't have to think about this crap. We have four turns. Oh, just stand and fight. Right, if I did the math, he should live by one. Why didn't I do the math? Was he getting... I don't know. He's dead. Of course. Ike's dead. It's over. <laughs> Who cares? <laughs> 72 day attack on that... So that wasn't, this wasn't a very fun one, was it? No mock battles. I guess I could try to whip up a mock battle, but nah. I'm going to take a break. Nope. Damn. I mean, that's a perfect week. Perfect defense. I don't know. Well, it's a perfect defensive week. I missed 40. Would that 40 have put me, would that have been enough to get me to top 1,000? I don't think so. I mean, it feels like you need to be in the 600s to, to get that. I just need more merges. I need more merges. Kind of a bummer that I'm just, I can't get it. I'm just on the fringe, both Light and Astra. I'm like literally 100 points away, or 100 ranks away. All right, let's, uh, since we've got some time, let's take a look at the leaderboards. Uh, is top players list, it's been a long time since we've looked at the top players list. Is this just full of 14,040s now? I imagine it must be. Ether Rage is getting a lot easier. With all the ladders and stupid units. Okay, well, no, it's still just uh, 27 perfects. I do expect at some point this to be all perfects. Hey, there's Fred and Freddy. Are you are you related? So to get top 50, ooh, a level a one star Donald with attack smoke too. Beautiful nemesis. It's beautiful there. There you go. That's your top 50, guys. You know anybody? Pat them on the back. Or do whatever you need to do to make them feel welcome. 
So Fred naturally takes number one based on the fact that he's on the top of the list. Shining Luda comes in at number two. MB right there at number three. Good job, MB. Must have been a good week. Titea. Hi, Owen. I don't know who that is. Serengo, SD, Felipe, Sven. Sven had a good defense this week. And Reek round out the top ten. That's a good score, Reek at all. Pretty good. I think that's the highest I've ever seen you. Um, and then there's me at 15. That's me. So I make no... <laughs> I don't pretend to say that I'm the best player in this game. That's not what we're here on the channel, guys. The channel's real main focus is to show you that anybody can play this mode with a little bit of thought. Just a little bit of thought, some little bit of planning, and then some assistance from the community. You can do it, guys. I mean, that's the point of this channel. It's Everything I use is free-to-play orbs, you know? So it's not like... It takes a rocket scientist or a rich dude to perform well here. All right, we'll end it there. It'll be a fast one today. We'll come back again next week. Do it all over again. We're going to use these units, same units we've been using. Although I mentioned this at the some point in the week, I don't know what to do for my light team. I have none of these units. That doesn't apply on offense. I've already blessed you on defense. I don't like re-blessing units for one week. Especially since I'm going to use this uh, uh, Eldigan on my actual defensive team. These have already been blessed to Astra. It's not win season. And sorry, Anna, you're not going to take an infantry spot. I mean, these are all infantry. Um, somebody made a point. I think it was Tiono made a point that these are always Grail units. I had no idea. I had no idea. So basically that explains why we've never had any interesting unit ever. It's always Grails, Legendaries. I mean, I always knew that was a Legendary spot. Asker unit, and then these, it's probably like it, oh, the Mythic, and then the latest Banner, basically. Why don't we have anybody from the General Pool? It just seems like that would be cool like, to mix things up. I don't know what the rationale was, but I'm going to have to think about it. I have no idea. It's probably going to end up being a Rebless, but I don't want to use Infantry. So... <laughs> Let me know, uh, tell me in the, uh, the comments what you guys are going to use for your unit, as I don't know. I guess, what wasn't, was it Ethelin was the four-star demote of this group? So I didn't manage to pull her. I guess if I would have, she'd be the unit I used. Damn, that's too bad. Is that banner still going on? Should I just go <laughs> pull on that real quick just so I can have a unit to use? I don't know. Uh, anything on your mind, uh, leave a comment. Talk to me on Discord. Find me on Twitter. Things like that. Like, comment, subscribe, guys. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye.